the government of Guam will have to start paying $11 million to pay down the Section 30 bonds it obtained to finance the construction of the Latzon landfill. This means trash rates for island residents and businesses could increase significantly over the next few years. The Guam Solid Waste Authority will be filing a petition with the Public Utilities Commission in November requesting that rates be established. While they are recommending that there not be an increase in rates, the authority understands that it might be required in order for the government to pay the bonds. To date, only interest payments were required and borrowed money was used to pay that interest, but the money will be exhausted by the end of the year. The bonds were to be paid directly from Section 30 revenues, but should the government wish to be reimbursed by ratepayers for the increase in debt service, the Solid Waste Authority advises the public that this could result in a substantial rate increase. Currently, commercial customers are paying $172 a month, while residential customers are paying $30 a month. Should an increase be necessary, starting next year, commercial rates could increase to $225 and remain that way through 2015, while residential monthly rates could increase to $35 in 2013, 40 bucks the following year, and $45 in 2015. Again, the GSWA is not recommending the rate increase, but understands that it may be necessary for the government in order to pay the bonds. Residents with opinions or comments can email gswrates at gmail.com. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm India.